Drops that behind his own net again. Painter on that heavy four check. Oh, turn Giving over. it up. Ely Newman. That's Josh. At pace now. Knocked on. Chased into the corner by Boyd. Followed in by Farn. Murray now goes to work on the boards. Farn uses his experience to come out with that. And we're in the final eight seconds now of the penalty kill. You can hear the Stretton fans behind Hepburn's net. That war chant as Tonar gains his own just as he go back to five on five. Wasted opportunity and we saw how important special teams plays were yesterday, George. Yeah, and they didn't generate a shot from that one. So... Stretton really doing well on the PK. However, we find now... Sorry! We are the ones who take the first points! Well, it's come after the power play. We'll see the replay again, George. Yeah, great work down low. 15, Solway. Feed. Boyd, I think it was, got just got the good goal side. Beg your pardon, Kieran Hare. Well, Kieran Hare was the assist. Uh, fed Boyd. And I think that went five hole on Annix. And it's not made a save yet. And uh, the first one through the wickets. Shot through the traffic right down the throat of Annette. And rebounds come out. Still poking away. Bentham couldn't quite reel it in. Fantastic series of saves by Annette. Bentham. And the PK unit of the Red Hawks once again doing its job. Almost a minute of the penalty gone. Gaffer. This is where they look to slow it down to get the puck moving, get it to the open Tried areas. Tried a shot. Picked up by Beatty on the far side. Put it through net. Well, it was a good effort. It got through the traffic. However, Annette did well to clear it back out. And there's a clear puck, Fierce but there's a little bit going of... on here between Farn and... Farn wants a piece of Boyd. Boyd just wants to get on with the game. And Farn has put himself in a poor position here. Oh. Well, it's already bubbling below the surface. 20 seconds left on the penalty. And the Stratton players certainly start to throw the body and now Kerr gets a puck over. Great little Could play by Ben Ely Newman, but turn back in. Stenton double teamed. Five seconds left on the penalty. Henderson has it taken off him. Trap door opens, out comes Waller. However, Anderson holds it up in the corner for the Sharks. Gets it out to Kerr at the point. Kerr lets one rip. Spilt yes. off! Well, Annette spilt the initial attempt off from Kerr and it's mopped up and in the back of the net. Yeah, Annette. Got a low shot here from Kerr that he kicked right towards. It looks like Henderson. Was it Henderson? Took it off his uh, took it off his foot. Made a quick little adjustment to get it in. Two 0 so well. 19-25. The first period, literally inside the final minute, and Solway bang another one in. It's now Solway Sharks two, Stretton Redhawks nil. It's going to be interesting to see, however, this second period now because things were starting to get to a, like a boiling point then, early in the first. We know there are agitators on the Solway side, Richie Bentham, Drew and Tonner, they will agitate and draw those penalties yeah. if need be. What can happen? We'll find out now as Mr Matthews goes to drop the puck for the second period and it's a draw in for the Red Hawks as they get underway. Under pressure immensely though by Boyd early on, forced to play it over. And it's a quick out by Bailey. They fed it forward. Good effort. As he goes to work in the corner, gets out once more. Good little drop play to Martelli. Martelli around the back of the net. Tried to find the open man on the back door. However, it's come all the way out. And the Red Hawks looking a little bit different already in this second period. Oh, good well, shot and attempt, and yes. it's in! And they are different because they've managed to get one on the net. Well, well George, look at this. Yeah, free-flowing stuff here. Beasley had just come back from covering Martelli at the point. A little spin move, which was just poked forward by Houston on defence. 
Inglesby and with fell the goal. straight to Inglesby in a position he couldn't really miss from. 40 seconds. Just like that. It's all it's taken. Yeah. The Red Hawks to get back in this. It's now Solway Sharks 2, Stretton Red Hawks 1. And the Red Hawks clear it out off the face off with Painter. So Hepburn takes his time. Here come the Sharks. Kurt. Looks where he's going to cycle the puck. Working it well. Gets it out in front. Shot yes. in! And Henderson makes it pay! Yeah. Well, it came off a skate, I think, on its way to, to the net. But the second guy, Henderson, trailing high. Can't miss from there. Especially with the goalie expecting the first shot. I've said in the intro, you have to watch out for Scott Henderson. Likes the quarterback a lot of things. Dangerous man himself. More points on the board. It's now Solway Sharks 3, Stretton Red Hawks 1. And we're approaching the two-minute mark in this second period. Tough break for the uh, Red, Red Hawks. They've played well. Uh, and obviously, a penalty like that can go against you sometimes when you're battling for the puck. But uh, Beasley will be undaunted. Well, okay. it's going to put a fire under the Red Hawks now. Can they do anything? They're stepping up the physicality again. Fawn sees his man off the puck. Picked up by Henderson. Stenton. Yeah, you can see. Stenton round three Red Hawks. He's got support in Gapper. Goes back and Gapper sits oh. down and net. Absolutely dangles him. But that all comes from the Stenton play. Well, beautiful. Stenton took it wide, pulled it inside, and Gapper waited, 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 dragged it, and tucked it in on the backhand. With that, it's now Solway Sharks four, Stretton Red Hawks one. Throwing our minds back to the uh, the introduction of the game, I did say that's exactly what Solway would do: shut the middle down, send them round wide. It's where they do the work best. But we two on one situation, and Bentham didn't realise he'd stop the play there, but a crucial little bit of work. And here come the Sharks once more with Houston. Ooh. Houston at pace, Boyd in the middle, gets it to Boyd. Oh. Well, wow, the save on that's got across post to post, gets the leg pad down. They're not finished yet, body off the puck. Boyd tried to get it over him, and Houston couldn't do it. Boyd's got the puck back. Sharks banging on the door here for a fifth. Puck comes flying in, nowhere near target this time. And that play breaks down, Painter clears his own. Sharks not over with this one. Stenton fans trying to get behind the team. Little body on there on Farn from Boyd. Loses his edge on the spin. They've managed to find an open man on the far side. Reeled in. Good opportunity. Oh. He skates it in himself. Well, it was Bailey initially who put the shot in. And the Solway defenseman hated with the, the yeah, assist. Yeah, that was, that was Beasley. Lovely check move on to the backhand, got it onto the pads and it's Kerr. And off the skates of Kerr. Kerr's played well today, he's got two assists, he's been important in a lot of the work that Solway has done but one of those agonising rebounds almost in slow-mo off his skate dribbling over the line. Give well, the Red Hawks a bit of life now. It's woken the Stretton fans up and some of the other fans here at Planet Ace Coventry. It's now Solway Sharks 4, Stretton Red Hawks 2. Well, I think it's worth saying that both of these clubs have had a fantastic season. Uh, you know, both outstanding winning records, um, you know, both developing great young players. So, all credit to Streatham. Uh, Face off win by. Know, they won't be too disappointed. Solway, throw the puck into the corner. Streatham, oh, tried to clear it down, but even in these dying seconds, Anderson. Just picked that one out of the air with his stick. Solway in control. Going to let that run all the way through to Arnett. 
And when you think of all the commitment and organisation and travelling that goes into a hockey left. season, you know, and it all ends here for these guys. Here well, Annette's the just gone to the bench. Sixth man is on. Open net. Gapper trying to dig the puck away. Time to get away. 15 seconds left. Pinned up against the boards. Cleared away out the zone, and that's pretty much going to be it. Gapper looking for a hat trick if he can just pull it Five loose. Five seconds no. left. Three, That'll two, do one. That'll do it. And the Solway Sharks are your Division One champions. Well, dare I say, George, I told Gary in the introduction they hadn't had a chance to fully stretch their legs. <laughs> now they have, and they've shown what they can do. As under that body of body somewhere is a Callum Hepburn who had an outstanding game. Stuart and Tanar. And there's your NIHL Division One champions, the Solway Sharks. Finish off the fairy tale season. Absolutely great.